Okay, Cassandra, so when you come into the house, you're just gonna come up the stairs and you're gonna ignore my completely dirty shop here. Um, Jacob's room is the last room over to the left over here. And this is where his animals are going to be. Can you turn the light on, buddy? Okay, so this is Jack. Um, this is the crested gecko. Uh, Jacob wrote the directions here for Jack. Um, you use this mix that will show you the food mix instructions. Um, it is this little mix right here. So we kind of left all of the stuff right here. Um, there's water and spray bottle. This is where the food is going to be. Um, are we feed we're feeding him tonight, right? Um, are you sure. feeding him tonight? Okay, we're, we're going to make a separate video of just how to make the food, but just want to show you where it's at. Um, this is Jack right here. You don't have to worry about his light or anything being on. If you see that it's not on, that's totally fine. Um, um, he is under, he's chilling right there. Um, okay. You can just put the food in a bottle cap and put it on the log, on top of the log where he's sitting or on the floor. Yes. Okay, so that's the bottle cap right there. You can get it and rinse it out. And then like he said, you can put it on the floor right there or just put it like up on the log for him to eat. And then that's his water. He gets a lot of dirt in there. It's okay. Um, just rinse that out and fill with water. You can also spray both of the sides with water, but like not too much. Yes. And then spray the glass, right? Yeah. Okay. So then you can spray, like use the, the thing to spray it down. Here, his cage, you just um push it. You kind of got to use both hands. So you push that down and you prop it open just like that. Um, he's the one that jumps. He normally does not jump when you open, but just be mindful. He's a jumper. Okay. So you can get the bottle cap and then got his food and you can just like spray, um, down in there. Okay. And if so, you want, you could hand feed him. Just get, um, a spoon with food on it and you just give it, put it in front of him. And he will he, lick it. He'll, he'll lick it. Yeah. If you put the spoon with the food, when you mix it, Put it right in front of him, have um, maybe Nicholas do it, and he'll get a kick out of watching him with his big tongue. Okay, here is our little high maintenance one right here. So this is Juju, and Jacob kind of put the instructions down for him, okay? He's our chameleon. He is, he normally will be chilling. He's right there. He'll normally either be there or he likes to hide over on the side right here. So just check on him, make sure he's good. Um, his cage opens up, you just switch right here and open. We do have two lights here. There's a UV light and there's a heat lamp for him. Those should be on all the time. Um, the little switches are here, but we're leaving them on. We did wind up getting a dripper. So this is going to drip little tidbits, you can see there's, it's dripping right here. So what we're hoping that you can check, um, just make sure that you, you do like see water dripping. He should come down here and be able to drink the water. But if you see that there's too much water in here by the time you come, if you can just dump some of it out because we don't want it overflowing. Um, this water right here is the water that goes into this. So it's pretty full. We filled it up pretty much to the top. Um, you can just unscrew the top and literally just pour some more water in there and that'll help with the drip system. Um, what you do is when you come, just get the spray bottle right here and just spray everything down. Like he really likes the leaves, yeah. right? So these leaves up here, that's typically where he comes to get his water. Um, do you spray the sides too, my love? Okay, so you can spray the sides a little bit, even up here where he's at, just spray it down. Okay, there's the thermos or the thermometer right there. Where the blue is, you, that's where you wanna be because that means the humidity is good in here. If, um, if anything, the humidity gets too high. It normally doesn't drop, right? When it gets hot, it gets higher. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. So you, when you come, you might see it a little bit higher. If, um, if it gets like in the 80s or 90s, you're going to open the cage door all the way up. Yes. If, if, if when you come, you see that it's between like 70 and 80, open the cage up just like this 
and let it air out for a little bit and you'll see the um you'll see it drop like kind of immediately when you do that that just means there's like it's too hot in there okay so there's that um now we bought the box of crickets for him okay so Jacob is going to open the box. There, there should be a good amount of supply in here so that you don't have to worry about putting crickets in there. So we will leave this inside the cage. There's a small little door right there and they kind of come out and he should be good as far as food. Um, where are you gonna leave this, like right here? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll leave it right here. Jacob will open it up tomorrow so that he has his food tomorrow. Just check, you might look around and kind of see if there's like crickets around. Um, if you don't see any out, they like to hide in here a lot. Just see, as long as you see one or two crickets, like it should be good. Or what you can do is like pick it up and maybe like shake some out a little bit and then they'll come out in the cage. Um, Jacob, this is the other one where we do the, the bag of crickets. Um, there are some in here so what jacob does is he normally just opens one side like this and that little egg crate it's kind of it's kind of dirty because we the there's the crickets are in there but let nicholas do this <laughs> just pick up the little egg crate and he can even shake um pick it and then shake some in there that's if so, these run out um oh yeah jacob said he he kind of taps the egg crate on here and then the crickets will fall off in there there's there's only a few in here. I don't know that they'll last by the time you you guys come. Jacob, you might need to put another carrot in there too. Okay. Um, there's maybe four or five in here. Actually, you should probably feed these to him tonight, huh? Sure. Before we open the box. So just, if anything, just, just watch for those and you moist it down there. Um, the directions, Jacob wrote his little directions here. And here, and you guys can always call us, um, just, you know, with questions or anything. And I think that's it, right? Mm -hmm. And then you can just come over here. The bathroom is right here. Um, I'll have, you know, the sink and stuff. Just come for, for the water right here. Um, this is where you're going to make his food right now, buddy? Mm -hmm. Make Jack's food? Yeah, I need to go down. I need to get a cup. Okay, we're going to make a separate video for, for him to make the food this is like the cup this is kind of what he does so we'll make a separate video to show you how to do the food and we'll leave the cups and everything everything all the supplies will be right here okay